Yo, what's up? It's Just a Kid, and welcome back to Rhyme. So, last episode, we, uh, we were figuring this guy out. He was following us around. I still don't know where we're taking him, but I guess there's only one way to find out, and that's to keep moving. So, okay. So, I need that, I, I assume. Huh. Nice. Alright, so... Oh, that just opens all the doors because there's no more light. Oh, snap! Get away from my baby! Why are these things coming out of nowhere is what I want to know. What are these things? Um... We kind of have no way to open the door. I kind of just used our only... Oh, there we are. Didn't even notice that opened up. So conveniently placed. So, do those... Those weird... Suck spirit thingies only come out when... Uh, it's, there's no light around? Well, obviously, because I hate the light. That's a dumb question. My bad. Do -do -do. Okay, break that down. Atta boy. Uh, of course, I forgot to. Just sick. Sorry about that. Let me. Let me turn this down. So, we need to get up here. Why don't you just step up? You've done it before. What are you waiting for? You okay? He's not even moving, like, at all. Okay. I hope he's not broken. Let's go around and show him where to go. Maybe that's what he's waiting for. There we are. Okay. He was waiting on us. Can you see me still? This way. So, I guess I'm just gonna keep running and he'll just follow me. Oh, no, that's a dead end. Um, climb, jump. This way. Don't worry about me, I'll find a way up. I'm resilient. I found you, didn't I? There we go. Alright, so where are we even going? Oh, we're going this way? Sorry. Um, okay. Uh, I don't know if I can get over there. Hmm. Must have to jump across. Okay, so come on over here. You're gonna have to jump. No, jump. No, okay. I thought that would be like a little ledge I can climb on as well. Okay. Let's see where this game wants me to go. Probably just overthinking it again. I need to jump through this hole. Yeah. Okay. Come on, Orby. Let's go. We got things on our docket. Oh, dang it. I hope I didn't need to be up there. He's getting the hang of walking. He used to be really bad at it, but now he's pretty good. Oh, snap. There are creepy people behind there. Okay, we're back in here. This is where you were born. Do you remember? Whoa! Um... Okay... What, what am I supposed to do here? Uh... 
Yeah, wow. What am I supposed to do? Or B. Oh, okay. That was your fault. You didn't know what to do. That's fine. I forgive you. I still love you. Even though I still think you're going to die soon. Hey, it's Fox A. Even Foxy likes Orby. Don't run around in circles, he'll fall. He's new at walking. I have no way to put him back up. We got the rhyme tower up there. Is that where we're going now? They seem to know where to go. Just a sec, I want to go break these. I still don't even know if these serve a purpose, but... Oh, well. Might as well do it. Okay, so. Moving on. So all the Orbeez really just want to get to the Rhyme Tower. Why do these break? I still want to know why. Where's Orby? I can hear him. Oh, he's down there already. You coming down, Fox? Nope. Okay. Later. Ew, you're gonna get your clothes all nasty. I'm sure this little cape rag was not cheap. Ah, yes. You're like an amplifier. So your only purpose in being created was for me to clear out these people. Ah, your purpose now becomes clear. Okay. So you're going to be my little amp, and I'm going to yell at this, and then you're going to, yeah, good job. Okay, let's move on. I know where to go from here, don't worry. I always go through the keyhole. A frag, what the? This isn't what I was supposed to be getting? Aw, oh, dang it, I'm missing so many. Orby? Am I going the Uh, okay. Orby knows where to go. I obviously don't. Because I thought that keyhole was where I was supposed to be trying to get to. Orby? 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 Ah, there you are. Okay. Let me, let me grab one of these orb things. Be right back, Orby. Just wait. They can't suck your soul out, but they can suck mine out. Then I get all creepy looking like the dark crystal. Be right back. Okay, camera angle, work with me. Thank you. Okay, so now we just gotta take this down to there. Then just give out a little shout. Everything at this point, I don't even know if these can really count as puzzles. Yeah, stay away from me. Look at this guy I got around me. Yeah, y'all don't want to mess with me. Me and Orby, we make a pretty good team. I don't even know why we're coming back this way. Was our only purpose in going that way was to get you, Orby? Oh, okay, whatever. It's like a really big infestation problem with these things. What did this king do? He must have messed up a lot of stuff. Okay, Orby. I need to know where we're going. You can't swim, so I think that's how I got here. I remember this place. Well, I think that he naturally wants to go to the Rhyme Tower, so might as well just follow him there. No questions asked. Yeah, this is where I met your, your old man. He's not dead, don't worry, I can wake him up. Don't be sad, he's not dead. Okay, I know this game is probably trying to make you feel bad about the robot, but he's not dead. I woke him up. That's how he led me here. 
And now he's going through that weird team phase where he's like, oh my god. The only person who understands me is dead. Ugh. All I have to do is get this orb and wake him up. Or if you could just come back in here, I could yell and you could amplify and he'd wake up. But, you know. Uh, you know teens. You know teenagers. Mm -mm -mm. Don't want to listen to reason. Just want to fester in their emotions. Or B. How did you get down here so fast? <laughs> yes, Orby. Look at the carnage of your people. Isn't it weird? Don't be sad. Oh, okay. Don't. Just keep moving then. Ow. Come on, Red. You gotta hurry up. It's pretty bad when a two legged robot that just learned to walk is out running, outpacing you pretty much. Ooh, snow. Hmm, Orby got over the death of his entire kind pretty quickly. Good job. He keeps his eye on the prize. Those aren't stairs. I thought they were. Okay. So, you're highlighting that to make a bridge that I don't know if I can get up to. Okay, that's not a door. I need a bridge right here. Are there any blocks or anything? I need a way to, hmm, how do I get up there is the question. Maybe I'm just approaching this the wrong way. Orby, come right here. Make these stairs. Now I can get up here. Okay. So I was... Oh, well, maybe I can't. Thanks, Foxy, for nothing. Now if I yell... Can I yell? No, it doesn't reach down there. As soon as I get up to this platform, I don't really need him here. Come on, kid. Or maybe I could just... Oh, God. I can't go all the way back down... Come on. Oh, man. I'm going to have to somehow find a way to get up these steps. Okay. Run, 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 run. Before he moves. There we go. Make the bridge. Atta, Orby. Now, what, what is this? Oh, we need a ball up there. Okay, so let's go this way, because it's the way Foxy was. Foxy. So you just bark at me a bunch, and then you just disappear. Oh, you went the wrong way, kid. My bad. Come up. There, there you go. Uh, okay, I guess we're going this way. Where to next? Um, must have to jump. Yep, yeah, okay. Ooh. That does not look very sturdy at all. But kids gotta do what kids gotta do. So, get over here. Jump right here. Okay. You wanna stick? No. Stand up. Stand up. There you go. And can you make that? Yeah, you can. Nice. And can you make that too? Nice. It this feels like it's about to break. Old wood, just you can't trust old wood. I wish this is one of the parts that they made out of gold, since I had a weird thing with gold everywhere. Ah, yes, this is what we need, I think. <laughs> Open. Hey, Orby, look what I got. You just stay there, because you like standing there for some reason. I'm going to go bring this over here. That'll move this little slidey platform over. Then I can carry an orb up, and then I can put it on there. Then I have to come back down, move this off, and then line up the orb with that little circle over there to make a key or a light or something. I don't know what I'm making yet. But it seems pretty straightforward. So... Let's just get this done. 
You better not move, Orby. You're going to mess everything up. It took me a long time to get you there. I'm probably going to have to redo the stairs again, aren't I? Yeah, yeah. Okay. So here's this. So... But now I have this block, so I don't even need Orby over there. So you move this back over here. Really wish they made these blocks more accessible. Whoever was the architect of this thing really did not plan it out well. Like, I don't know why you say, like, yeah, we have three platforms that need pressure on them in order to get this slidey thing open to make this light. I'm going to put the one block that you need all the way up in this room. And then you have to climb up this cellar. Or, I guess it probably would have been some sort of wooden staircase or something. But, I don't know. Just, just bad architecture in my opinion. Orby, you want to come with me now? Look, there's a big glowy ball over here. It's probably going to wake up all these people of yours that you'd like. No, I think he's scared. Look at that. All the oldies coming out. Yeah. We did it, Orby. We awoke in your family, your species. You're no longer extinct. Let's see how he greets them. Wait, where are y'all going? This one looks really bad off. He's an old one. Wait, where's Orby? Have you seen Orby? He looks like you, but he's new and shiny. Is that Orby over there? Yeah, that is. Oh wait, no it's not. Who the heck are you? Who the heck are y'all? What the? I can't tell which one is mine. Stop. Stop. No, where's Orby? Where am I supposed to go? I assume that those are stairs for them, so I can't even get up there. Orby must be in that other room. I really wish he'd tell me where he'd go sometimes. Orby. He's growing up so fast. He's becoming so independent. I wish I could run fast. Hey, here y'all are. Orby! Are you ready? I'm gonna yell at this thing. I think it's gonna do something you'd like. No, yell. Okay. Okay, Orby is standing there. I'm not really sure what to do here. What about this OG Orby over here? You gonna wake up? I bet you will after I'm done. Oh, I need to stand on that. Okay. I need... It's a shadow thing. I didn't see, notice it. There we are. Door open. Don't move, Orby. Or does it just stay open? Okay. Safi. You don't... You don't go yiping, okay? Okay, so We're in here now I assume you need to go up those and I will go up here Meet you on the other side Orby Based on the music I'd have to think oh are we done? Oh nice we're done Okay, well this video has barely even started And now we tell the tale of the Orby Hey, wait, the OG Orby didn't wake up. That sucks. Is that really it? Uh, let me let my dog out in a sec.
Like, is that really it? I thought that there would be a little bit more. For some reason, I just feel like it's not complete. Hmm. Oh, well. So, so is the tale of Orby in Red, reviving his civilization for some reason. I don't really know why. <laughs> it's probably... I'm probably gonna be slowly restoring this kingdom. Slowly but surely. So, I assume another keyhole. How many more keyholes are there? I think this is the last one. I wonder... So maybe this video, these uh, series will only be a couple more episodes. Hey! You're the old creepy one that I don't like. Where's my son? Orby! Orby! Maybe he's following me. Oh well. Uh, now we're gonna be taking forever. Swim! Can I dive? Oh, I can. That's cool. Oh, y'all can walk underwater? That's pretty tight. So, is this gonna be some sort of water keyhole? Doesn't really seem very screenshot worthy in my opinion. At least I actually swam through it and then it happened. Let's see what kind of cutscene we get. Back on the boat. Ask for a miracle. W. Hey! Get off my boat! <laughs> what are you doing? And why does your voice sound so wimpy? Oh no! Save him! Do you not have a face? No! Oh, that's where my cape came from. Okay. I kind of ripped it off of yours. My bad. I still don't know who that is, though. Hopefully I didn't miss too much. Okay, Orby. I think this is Orby. I really hope it is. And if it's not, it is now. So, where are we headed? Can't really look around either. Can I move? Nope. Thanks, Orby. Why are you scared? There's nothing here. Stop being such a little wimp. Or are you crying? Yeah, you are crying. Why? Must be another weird grave or memorial thing. So emotional. Okay. What do we do here? Not gonna hum. Okay, Orby, I'm following you. I'm glad Orby didn't die. For some reason, I felt like he was gonna die. Maybe it's cause like I keep getting, I keep getting those Last Guardian kind of feel from this game, and that one, the Last Guardian, the Trico, ended up pretty much dying in my opinion. He was so tore up, and I hated how they made you like force him to leave. I love that thing so much. Oops. Sorry. Okay, so... This rain is kind of hard to see through. Hey, what's that up there? Is that Foxy? Oh, you're all wet. Yeah, I can see you. Don't worry about it. Okay, so these must be the Throne of Tears. So I've seen uh, four thrones, I think, so far. All of them have different things going on with them, I guess. Alright, what's this? Oh, snap. Oh, now you're not afraid of them? Okay. Yeah, I'm about the same way, just like, um... Alright. 
One second you guys are afraid of me, then one second you guys want to suck my soul out, then one second you're fine again? Okay, whatever. Whatever y'all do, you do. Come on, Orby. Keep up with the gang. It's a nice little crew we got here. We got Foxy, Orby, and me. It's a nice little big three. What is it doing? He sacrificed himself, and he turned into a door? Well, at least it's not Orby. Orby better not sacrifice himself, because I literally just said I'm glad he's alive. Best not play with my feelings like that. Okay. Into this place. Uh, where am I? What, what is this? Can I move? What the heck is... I can't even see in there. I have no idea what this is. Okay, it must not be important. I'll just keep following my orb, buddy. Thanks for waiting up on me. But I can't get up there. Orby, where are you going, friend? Okay, Orby's back here. Oh, very, very crafty. You got some strong legs. You don't skip leg day. Don't forget who gave you those legs, Orby, whenever you want to try to get rebellious with me. I did. Also like it how they make it still clear what you can and cannot grab onto with the edges because the water makes it... Like, it comes off the edges differently so you can still see it. I think that's a pretty cool touch. But it doesn't take away from the effect of the rain. Okay, so now come up here, come up here. So red is sad for some reason. And I want to figure out why. Huh. Ooh, that was close. Yep, that would have been death. I don't know if Foxy would have saved me from that one. Hey, Foxy. Dang, Orby. You are so strong. He just breaks down whatever he wants. Oh man, this like I need to wipe my nose. Uh. Summer is definitely my allergy season. Okay, so let's get back up here, I guess. Or B. I didn't get to see where he went. But the game will guide me. Foxy looks so sad. <laughs> he's, all, he's all wet. She's all wet. It's all wet. I don't know. I still think it's a she, but that's just me personally. Okay, always make the old ones open the door, Orby. I'm not letting you become a door. Thank you for your sacrifice. Why the heck do we make these doors so complicated? If this is like my like race or origin of people, if this is my people. My ancestors. Why the heck are y'all making doors that require us to make robots just to become a door? Why would you do that? And then you give the robots feelings. Oh, this is a clearing. Orby. Come by my side. I don't want you to get scared. <laughs> I feel like, oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I knew this was going to happen. Oh my god. Dang it, Orby. Fine. Come on. Come become a door. You were literally just born. Yet you have so many responsibilities. Oh. 
Orby. Yeah, yeah. We all saw that coming, kid. I'm sorry, but... We all knew it was gonna happen. Well, I knew it was gonna happen. Bye, Orby. I love you. Now become a door so I can go through it. Hey, we still got Foxy. Foxy's not gonna become a door. Hey, you're actually letting me touch you. Okay, moving on. Good little moment there, but it was kind of obvious. Let's keep moving. Huh. Huh. Oh god. Ah! <laughs> Dang it. I got into the moment I was like, yeah, I can make that jump. Uh, yeah, I can make that jump. Come on. Let's see. Then where do we jump from? Do we jump from right here? This little ledge? Okay. Ooh. Oh, nice. You didn't even have to grab onto anything. Okay. Now, what is this? A nice little statue? I probably should have took a screenshot of Orby dying. That would have been a good thumbnail. Hey, it's me! Are you, are you... Man, you're just really sad. Are you guys gonna suck my soul out again? No? Now they're just chill. They're neither afraid of me or, or want to eat me. So this... I assume that this is gonna be kind of like the last puzzle. Kind of bringing it all back. Because the first puzzle was like this, and now the last one's going to be like it. I need to find those little thingies, those little statues. Excuse me. Thank you for not, try like, sucking my soul out. You can give, you can, like, put the essence of them in there. Or, Foxy, why didn't you ever tell me you could do that? Huh? This is so dangerous. Yeah, don't quit talking to me. I don't feel like it. Um. Oh, man, the rain. I can sometimes barely see through it. Come on. Foxy. I'm following this little path, I think, but I can't... Ooh, what's this? A looky hole. I think I've only seen like two or three of these so far. Oh, okay, so the queen died. I wonder if those are like little story things, and I probably have a lot more to go than I think. Okay, well, let's keep moving. Hello, lady. So, everyone is mourning the death of my mother. Man. I was just a little kid. So maybe that's what the little grave was under the water in that first part. It was my mom? I think? Uh, <laughs> I'm saying it like that because I'm not really sure yet. So the king is my dad. I don't know if the king and the red cape guy are the same person. Maybe they are. Maybe he got his soul sucked out by one of these people and he turned black. Because when I got, like, when I got killed by one, I turned black. So maybe that's what happened to him, too. He just turned black and then, yeah, that's what happened. Is this, like, some sort of seesaw thing? If only Orby were here, he'd be able to crank that one down with his super powerful legs. But he's not. So, need to find a different way up. This looks like it will work. That a boy. That a boy, Red. Come on. What do we do from here? What would that do? Wow. What a conveniently placed fountain. Whatever. It'll work. I ain't complaining. I know for sure that there are a lot more of Orby's, like, little robot friends than just that many. I think there are only two that, like, open the door. 
But when I was walking in there, there were a lot coming out. Orby did not need to sacrifice himself. But once you see that clearing, you know. So, Foxy, are you my mom? Are you like a reincarnation of her and you're sad that you're died? You're dead? I'm pretty sure that's not it. But it would be interesting if it was. So, oh my god, so much distance in between. Ooh! Well, don't gotta worry about it now. There's so much distance in between these statues. Ugh. Come on, keep going, kid. So... That's all I really got. <laughs> I've, I've, like, spit out most of the theories that I have on this game. I even, like, I think the most accurate one so far that I'm pretty sure is going to be right since I called Orby's demise, I have to assume that his dad also got his soul taken away somehow. Or maybe it's not even his soul, but he just got all his color sucked out. And that's fine too, because he seems to still be alive. Because I thought the reason he was a shadow was because it wanted to add some sort of mystery to it. But no, he's actually a shadow. Which is fine, we don't judge. You a shadow if you if you ain't. I want to know how my mom died. If that's my mom, how how do what the heck? Oh, that would have been nice to see. Oh God, red. Oh, I'm still crying. Okay. I should have known because of the rain that this would have been sad. Get on up, jump across. All right. Probably gonna have to jump down again. Can you like sneak across? No. What are these? These like little, oh well. Just break it, destroy your mother's memorial. For what reason, I do not know. Are you serious? You're gonna make me- Ugh, okay. Are there any more before I move on? No? Okay. Do-do-do. Do-do-do-do. Huh. Got it. Okay. He has some really nice fingers. Like, he's got some strong grips. Because he's even clutching onto these things when it's wet. I would have been slipping like all over the place. Almost there. Uh, I think, is this the third one? I think so. So, one more after this. Not sure what's going to happen. Why can't you just do that? <sighs> Whatever. So, the only thing I am wondering is, oops, the only thing I'm wondering is, why, how would they make a statue of me with a cape if I just got my cape when I got here? So, I'm not really sure if I am that little boy, like, but in the statue and stuff, because I just got my cape before I crashed here. So how would they even have a statue of me? That's the only thing that doesn't make sense. And when he was on the boat, he was calling out to the red guy like he didn't know him. Because he was saying, hey, hey, who, who the heck are you? That's what it kind of seemed like to me. I could be wrong, but that's what it seemed like. I'm not really sure if they're even related yet. I think at this point it would make a little bit more sense that red here is not related to them but then again something else could happen that proves that there would be no real other reason for him to be sad if oh dang it well that's what editing is for back up 
But yeah, there'd be no other reason, in my opinion, for him to be sad, unless this is actually his family. But then again, he also doesn't know a lot about this world, because he's navigating through it like he's never been here before. Okay, where do I go next? Do I... Uh, so many choices. I'm gonna go here. I think I made the right choice. Excellent. Jump back. Can you not jump? There you go. Huh. Huh. Leap. Good job. I thought I was about to fall off the edge. Huh. Got it. So, last statue. Finally. Huh. Man, you must be so tired. So why are you sad, Foxy? What are you? I still don't even know. There. Final one. Now, now where do I go, Foxy? Can you guide me back? No. Thanks, Foxy. You the real MVP. Lead me all the way out here. It's probably in a circle, so... It probably is just going to take me back when I go over here. I know what to do here. Now, let's see what this brings. Is it going to be a little me? Oh, he's happy. Oh, is Foxy dying too? Thanks for your help, Foxy. Where are you going, though? How do we know if Foxy's even dead? What is this? What the heck? Uh, I'm gonna be black now, aren't I? Yo! What the heck is happening? Why was... Come on, get out. Oh, I have to keep pressing it. Okay. Okay, so... Apparently in this world, when you're really sad about someone dying... You turn black. You turn into a Heartless from... Kingdom Hearts. Do I still have powers? Oh no, I'm all slow. Okay, now I'm fast. I can't yell anymore. My voice. My beautiful voice. What has happened to it? Oh no. So I am their son. Oh dang it. My beautiful pipes. Oh man. Wait, so now, what happened to Foxy though? Because it's all good and dandy that they use Foxy as another little death thing. But where is she? Because it didn't seem like she died exactly. She just became part of the statue. Because that's where I got her from anyway. Like in the first part, I got her from a statue. There's just a few more things about this game that I can't understand. Like, I understand that my dad and I are now black, and I guess we can't really talk anymore. I'm just not really sure why. Come on, can you grab onto that, please? No? Oh, you can. Okay, great. Uh, go this way. Climb up. Come up. Well, probably should have stayed over there. My bad. Ooh, nice. Do I get any cool powers now that... Oh, okay. Thank goodness you reset me right here. I would have been a little ticked off if I wasn't. 
I can barely even see myself. Thank goodness you're wearing this red cape. So, I guess we have to wait until the camera turns with us. Okay. It's moving a little too fast for the camera, I guess. So, come over here. Please don't fall off the edge. That would also be kind of annoying. Ah, another ball. Wait, why do I need to go over there? This episode might be a little bit longer. I want to finish out this game. I feel like it's almost over. Oh, dang it, I did it again. Okay, I need to press shift. My bad. Almost done with this game. Still don't know the controls. Oh, well. Come on up. Get up. Can't, can't get up yet? Okay. So am I just not supposed to... Oh, I have to drop down. Okay. Okay, so where? Oh, oh, dang it! I'm alive. How? Okay, whatever. I'll take it. So now I need to come up here. Come on, come on, kid. Up, up, jump. You're really good at this. You should have been like going to American Ninja Warrior. You got some talent, kid. You can go by the Shadow. That's a really cool name. It's kind of overused, but still, it's cool. So, where are we going? I kind of like you more when you weren't all creepy with your weird glowy eyes. I can't see. Okay. So, here we are. The camera is turned up almost all the way, too. So, I don't even know. It's just really dark. Okay, so shine some light in another place I'm supposed to go. Thanks. Ah. Uh. I'm alive. <laughs> I keep getting so lucky with these. I don't even see what's over there. I guess I'm not supposed to because there's no light there. Okay. Come on back over here. There we are. Oop. Come on. Do we need to climb this? Ah, oh, cool. Don't slip. You will die. So that's the last one. You better duck out the way. It's gonna drop down on you. Or not. Hey, I got some more color. Yeah. Yeah, you noticed it too. Is this water? What is this? That's, that's cool. Okay. So, there's a ball here, and I assume I need to stand right here in order to cast a shadow. And we are at the top of the tower, I think. It's purely speculative. What now? Wait a sec, why are the stairs upside down? Oh, I'm upside down? Oh, that's cool. Now I can defy gravity. Ah, uh, so we can recount everything that we've seen so far. The time I met Foxy for the first time, who is now dead. All I had to do was yell at, a f like, what, four statues? Ow, you f- <laughs> Why do you mess everything up? <laughs> You got the weird, the weird creepy ladies, and an upside down keyhole. Man, you recover quick. I saw you, like, I see you out here. You hustling. Okay, so. Now that we're upside down, this must be my keyhole. Because it has my statues around it. 
Wow, this is trippy. Do I have to... What the heck? I'm walking on the ceiling. You okay? How do I get in there? Do I have to crawl through the hole? What is what is the meaning of this? Let me take a cool screenshot again. I know I've been in here before, but it's gonna make a tight wallpaper, trust me. Okay. So going to this keyhole again. I guess. Still not really sure why I'm upside down. Or why do I even get some color back? No hope. Nice. Great achievement. <gasps> Who is this? What the heck is happening now? Come on, come on, you can get to him. What's his name? He's saying something, what's... Hey, that's me, what the heck? You can't lift a child? I think he was saying his name and it did not sound like red. I didn't know, I can't hear what it was. Okay, so now we're back at the Rhyme Tower. I think it's the original one. Which is weird, because they're wearing some pretty modern clothing. And... I'm sleeping on a rock. Or is this a weird bed? Hmm. This is interesting. Are you cold? You're gonna have to stay cold for a little bit longer, because I'm gonna end this episode here. I know that I said I wanted to finish out this game, but... Now, maybe I shouldn't. Uh, I'm so scared, because... I, I don't want to have like a five minute episode if this is the last part, then I don't really know where to stop. Okay, I'm just going to say this is the this is uh, where I'm going to stop for now. Very interesting. Uh, I thought this, this was in a time period where it's like more ancient, but I guess because they were wearing those really modern clothing, I don't know now. It's interesting. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Rhyme, and... Remember, deep down, we're all just a kid. Peace. Yo, what's up? It's Just a Kid. I hope you guys enjoyed the show. Remember to subscribe and also check out some of the videos over here. I'll catch y'all later. Peace.